Hi guys, so I am here with a dog training collar. So with this collar, it does come with a remote. Um, this is how you turn on the remote, that, that power button, and clicking it locks. So um, what that means is you can, you can press all these functions down here and absolutely nothing's going to happen. Um, so we're going to click that and unlock so we can just kind of show you what's going on here. So just to kind of give you an idea, with this one it shows you the mode. Um, and this over here is on the left is going to show you if it's um, on a shock mode, vibrating mode, or sound mode. Um, there's a dog number one and a dog number two and so to get to that um, you can see right here there's a dog number one. If I flip that switch, dog number two, but we're going to stick with dog number one today. Um, this right here shows the battery level in the middle, just kind of give you an idea where your battery level is. Um, so with this, first of all, our first thing we have on our keypad here is we've got a light. So this is what the light looks like. It's at the very top of your receiver here. Um, to turn that off, you just click that button again, turns off. The second one down is the sound. And that is happening here on the collar. So with the sound, there is no other, you can't go up and down in intensity. It is just what it is. Um, the second one down, or the third one down, I'm sorry, is the vibration. So I don't know if you could hear that, but we're at level one. It goes all the way up to level 16. It just gets more intense as you go up. So that's something you could do there. Um, or if you wanted to do the shock function down here, um, you can go up in intensity here and it, it just shows you here what this looks like. So you can see that light indication um, and if you can go all the way up to 16 again and that's really what that looks like so um, that is an option for you and with this we're gonna go ahead and turn off or turn on to vibration because we can handle vibration mode just in case something happens we'll go ahead and lock our keypad so we can't do anything so I can talk more about the collar uh, so it can go up to 1,600 feet. So you really have some range here that you can be um, training your dogs with your dogs. Um, this is a waterproof product, so you don't have to worry about getting it wet, which is really nice. Um, this is that charging port down here with the power button and these two prongs here. So it does come with like replacement prongs and replacement um, like rubber um, like rubber thing here so you can do this with like long hair or short hair dogs which is really nice um, this really the only function was just to show you the um, shock function and with the remote here so we do have a clip on it so it is for easy carrying you can just clip it onto your belt um, this holds a charge for up to 30 days and this holds a charge for up to 15 days so just kind of watch this charge and make sure that this is good um, so now I'm going to show you what this looks like on my dog. You can see this is what that collar looks like on my dog and it does have an adjustable strap to it so it can fit him or a bigger dog if need be. But that's what it looks like on him. Um, if you are interested in training your dog, getting this for your dog, definitely go check it out on Amazon.